with your uncle you guys did you live with him at first or like how come you didn't live with oh you so you did but mm-hmm. then when your siblings left what happened yeah, why didn't did. you still live with your uncle no we all stay with my uncle we all stay with my uncle for like a year year and a half we, we stay with my uncle it was just a pack house he had two kids he had his wife everything it's a nice big house too but it was just packing and of course, the goal is always to move out and get your own house. So that's what happened. Like a year and a half later, we ended up getting our own place. That's all that happened. And then, you know, life goes on, man. It's kind of crazy because, like, the way life is, like, you can be around your family every day or whoever you're around every day, that is your family. That really is your family. Whoever you're around every day, that is your family because, like, you got family so far across the world and they love you, right? Like, I've had times where I'm like, man, my family don't care, right? But I get with them and then you can see how much they care about you. It's just that when you're not together, life just goes on and people gotta understand that. And like, I'm over here all the way in Guam and I feel some type of way, right? But when I meet up with them and talk to them and I hear their story, they feel some type of way. Like, I'm over yeah. here just on the side. They feel exactly how I felt. And I'm like, oh, I like, we both care. We both care so much. But we're just not around each other like that. And it just, you know, that's how life is. People just have to understand, like, just because you're not around them every day and stuff like that don't mean they don't love you or anything like that. It's just, like, life just is what it is. It Crazy. moves like that. You know, and I even... Even I have to realize that, like, so the people that I am around every day, like, that's kind of your family. Yeah, true. About the time. That is your family. Like, everyone you're around consistently, like, friends, whoever, that's your family. Like, yeah, because you always is. have, like, these different phases. <laughs> like, people who were at your freaking birthday party when you were, like, 15, you know, they're not, it's like maybe one of them, two of them are there now or something, shit like that. So, yeah. Yeah, for real, for real. So, yes. Yeah. One thing about me and my friends, my real group of friends, we're all still close. So I hear it all the time, like me and my boy Drew, my boy Matt, all of us, like when we're all together, and there's more of us, but when we're all together, people are like tripping, like how are you guys still t- together? Like back then we used to train at dry cell and everything. Everyone's like freaking out, freaking out on our camaraderie, like all the way through, never changed. Like been going there for 10 years now and still like same energy like we're still sticking together people will write us like oh you guys are still friends that's that's amazing like a lot of people like a lot of people famous people everyone that knows like they they know like me and my boys that are my regular crews yeah never changed like we only lost one that's it you we guys just stayed lost together one, but my boys are pretty uh always we're always together no matter when we're far apart like we 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 get on the phone, we, we talk in the group chat with multiple people, and we act dumb still all the time, you know, even though we're not with each other, so, yeah, uh, I've seen a lot of groups and friends fall off, man, over dumb shit, and I don't know why, bro, like, if you could fall off that easy, you weren't mm-hmm. really friends, yeah, you know what I mean? I feel that. So, all that, you know, and nothing should, nothing should get in the way. One thing I'm good at, is I don't put expectations on any of my friends, like, it's kind of weird, but I'm not going to, um, just because my other friend does something for me, I'm not going to put that expectation on you and then have myself second guessing you because you can't do that for me. Like, I know each of my friends and I know what they're my friend for. So I keep them in that line, you know, and it's fine. It's good. They're, they're all equally my friend, but I know exactly what I'm getting out of each friend or giving to each friend. Or, what you know, I know I'm in tune with what's going on. I'm not, like, trying to say, oh, Justin did this for me, and you can't even do this yeah, for me. Yeah, because then like, it takes away what you, you do know, for them. No, it makes it I'm not, not gonna, genuine because you, like, hope. I'm not going to put – yeah. I'm not just going to put that expectation on you. Like, I know what I get out of each friend's. Like, I got friends that are still, like, bums still, you know? Like, when I got other friends, it's like, how you come you still hanging around with that guy or you still mess with that guy? It's like, bro, everyone's my friend for a different reason, like, I'm not putting expectations on him. I'm not putting yeah. expectations on you. He is who he is. Like, I'm just cool like that. You know what yeah. I mean? Yeah, he is who he is. You know what I mean? He's still funny. He still makes me laugh. He's still dumb. He's still cool. You know, he's just not doing yeah. good in life. But, you know, he's still a cool guy. You know, he's still, you know, he's still my friend for when he's my friend. You know what I mean? He's just not, you know, doing good in life. So, you know, but, you know, sometimes they're yeah, still cool. Facts, you know I think I mean? a lot of people could get a good lesson out of that. <laughs> 